Hey guys, Chevy here again. I'm out here working on the bus at my house. Well, soon to not be my house. We got, I don't remember, I think it's... What is today? It's the 12th. So we have eight days until this house closes. Uh, the house in Texas closes the 17th, which is five days. Everything's happening really fast. So, I got my parts yesterday for the bus. I got the backup camera and my good headlights and I already put the light bar on but I figured I'd show you guys that stuff I'm right in the middle installing the backup camera but put four sided LEDs in it high and lows crystal glass lenses and that 42 inch light bar take you to the back I already got up there and drilled a hole, mounted the backup camera up there. I know the self-tappers are ugly, but whatever. So we'll be able to see this when we're backing up this giant Twinkie, which is going to be great. Because I've tried backing up the trailer with it, and it is not great. Not at all. So anyways, I oh, got the paneling tore loose so I just got to feed cable now I got it all all the screws off all the way down gotta stick the cable up inside there all the way down there's a lot of Phillips screws man I'm super tired of it this one right here wouldn't come out so I just had to yank it over the screw so I'll have to deal with that later but I mounted the screen here. Nice little seven inch display. Be perfect. Gonna, like I said, running all the wiring up behind this panel here. So this will all tuck in there really nice. And the only thing you have to hook up on this thing is power and ground, constant. And then your backup lights so reverse trigger and it comes on or you can hook it up to a toggle switch or whatever I'm gonna hook it up to the reverse trigger and uh, that's gonna be really nice so I'll prop you guys somewhere and I'll start running cable so it come with a different couple different lengths of cable uh, for like a truck or a motor home or whatever and it comes with two cables that way you can have one hooked in like your fifth wheel and you can just hook it up with the hitch which is seems like kind of a shitty idea to me a little tiny pin connector eh, just getting dirt in it probably just wouldn't work more than once but this is gonna this is gonna work great i got the cable stretched out need to make sure it's got a female and a male in so I guess this is male, the other one's female, but uh, this one has to go forward because that's the connection for the display. The camera has the other end. So I'm going to start up here, tuck this in. Turn and look this way. You guys think pretty boring, huh? Just stuffing all that cable in the wall over here so I can reach up through the bottom and hopefully get the hold of it. Otherwise, I might have to go get like a coat hanger or some bale of wire or something. Build myself a little fish tape. That's not far. I should be able to do it. Cool. Now I can put this piece back in. Awesome.
Got it. Now I just gotta find the camera one over here. There it is. Oh, shit. Of course it's not long enough. Now I've screwed together up in there where I can't see. There he goes. I think you guys can see. Can you see? You should. You should be up there. All right. That's hooked up. Now we just have to do battery ground and power and a reverse trigger that's pretty friggin cool pretty dang exciting I've never had any fancy stuff like this <laughs> can't even tell man there's a lot of stuff in here okay guys up here in the front seat Got the cable ran up to here. Now I got a. It hooks up to here. And I need to do battery and ground and then reverse trigger. And then we hook that monitor up to here. So I'm going to go get a square head, pull these screws out, and I'm going to. Steal the power from there because there's battery and ground in there. And then I think I'm going to hide everything in that box too. Be really easy. Heck yeah. Yep. Throw a hole in it. Stick that stuff through. Dang, I should have mounted that screen up top. Nah, it'll be easier to switch between the mirrors and that screen with it there instead of up there. Then I'll just have to run a wire out of there to shit I don't know there's no switch it's a button dang uh well I guess I'll figure that out when I get there <laughs> maybe I'll look on the old Google it never lets me down all right stay <laughs> Square bit, not my favorite. I got a bunch of Phillips, I could probably swap those out. Yeah, that's a good idea. Let's do that. We ain't gotta get the stupid bit next time. Good idea. Get off of there. one-handed is difficult okay I know I'm sorry black tape it'll be all right all right got the power and ground hooked up got a hole drilled got to hook this camera piece up but I physically can't do it with one hand I don't think so just a second okay that one's hooked up oh hell this one's gonna be hard too No way. I got it with one hand. What the? Check that out. Ugh. It's on. Shit. <laughs> Guess I need to hook it up to key power then, huh? That's pretty rad, though. Power? Oh, cool. I just have to turn it off. Dang, that's pretty rad. 
pretty good definition on it. It's better than it looks on my phone. Got Lisa's Toyota, PD, the Talon, the neighbor's car. Holy cow, I can see all the way down to the mysterious road, whatever that road is. <laughs> cool. Well, that wasn't too bad. I'll get this stuck back up in there. It'll be good to go. Well, there it is. Totally official. I even flipped the stereo over and put it back in so that thing wasn't upside down. But yeah, cool. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> it's now right here in the dark. I want to test out my headlights. I want to see this camera in the dark, see how it looks. Oh, dang. That's good. I know this headlight's coming up, so let's... Shit, that ain't headlights. That's a street light. Dang, that's that's pretty good. It looks like a glare on here, but dang, that's the street lit up in the middle. Dang, that's freaking incredible. This thing's gonna be caked to back up. All right, quit screwing around. I'm gonna turn the headlights on. Check those out. Boom. I need to turn the brights off. <laughs> Sorry about your eyeballs, dude. Damn, those lights are good. That's so much better than the old ones. I'm going to have to aim them. Because they're up in the damn tree up there up there on that tree that's not where I need to see I need to see down here they look good though dang all right I'm done screwing around I've been going for a long time now I don't know what time it is come on six o'clock okay only 13 hours that's not too bad but bus is pretty much ready to go just strapping stuff down finish loading it up and we'll be good I got a couple weeks left. Dang, I'm excited. See you guys next time.